Let's study about geometry. First topic, point. We use a dot to represent a point. We use a dot to represent a point. Yes, this is a dot. So, this is a point A. And this is a point B. And this is point C. That is, a dot represents a point. It means a location. Next one, line segment. The shortest distance between two points in a plane is called a line segment. The shortest distance between two points in a plane is called a line segment. Therefore, for a line segment, there will be a starting point and ending point. So, there will be two end points for a line segment. So, if there is a point A and there is a point B in this plane, the shortest distance between these two points, we can draw like this. This line segment, it is the shortest distance between these two points and it can be written like this. It can be read as line segment AB. Line segment AB. So there is an end point here. Here also an end point. So for a line segment, both sides there will be end points. And the next topic is a ray. A ray is a line segment which extends endlessly in one direction. A ray is also a line segment. But it extends endlessly in one direction. So what are things we discussed today? First one, a point. A dot is used to represent a point. And the next one we discussed the line segment. A line segment is the shortest distance between two points in a plane. Line segment is the shortest distance between two points in a plane. And the next one is a ray. A ray is a line segment which extends only in one direction. Or we can say that a line is also a line segment which extends endlessly in one direction. And the last one is a line. A line is a line segment which extends endlessly in both directions. So it is going on both directions endlessly.